the Sci-Fi Invasion. I'm your host, Joey Hollywood, and I'm trying to get through all 50 movies in this 50 movie pack from Mill Creek in 50 weeks. We have another Hercules movie, another non-sci-fi movie in the sci-fi box set. Uh, this one's called Hercules and the Tyrants of Babylon. This one, I think, might be the worst on this whole disc. This disc of four Hercules movies, I think this is the worst. This is these, this one's so by the numbers a Hercules movie. It's just Hercules going from thing to thing, no stakes, there's the lovebird plot, and it ends with the city being destroyed. It, it, you've, you've seen one of these movies, you've seen most of them, and they put all four of them in one disc, so I can't even spread it out <laughs> over the course of this year. I suppose I could have, but then that would require a little bit more thought than I want to put into something like 50 movies in 50 weeks. <laughs> but some notable stuff about this one, one of the villains in the movie looks like, uh, like, a, like Bing Kingsley. He looks like his, he could be his dad. I don't know, that was noticeable. There, you know, <laughs> you know the movie sucks when you're like, the, the positives are like, oh yeah, well, this one actor looked like another actor I liked. The story of this one is Hercules comes back to Babylon to find, or not Babylon, I think he's, I think he's returning to Thebes? He's returning home, and it's infested with Babylonians. And this movie's kind of about Hercules freeing his people from the Babylonians. With a lot of Hercules movies, but this one in particular, it feels like it's just scenes happening. There's no story being told. It's just, this is happening now, this is happening now. There are a couple interesting things in the movie. Actually, there's there's one part of the movie I found interesting. Like, from a story perspective, or just, just watching the movie, it was a little bit more interesting to, to view. But there's a scene where there's a bunch of women tied to stakes. And one of them, I believe, is a queen. The Queen of Helen. That's what it is. Uh, it's the Queen of Helen. And one of, one of the girls yells, I'm the Queen of, of Helen. And then all of the girls start screaming it. And the guy who's about to put them to death is like, well, whatever. But then a wise man sees like a dove and he's like, no, it's a sign. Let them all free. And it feels like that should really go somewhere, but it... It never really does. It's just like, it, like I said, it just feels like scenes that are happening. I wouldn't be, I wouldn't be surprised if this was a movie made up of other movies, because it nothing really flows into the next scene, and it's one of the more challenging movies I had to sit through on this particular box set. I feel like the last box set we had, there was a lot of movies on there that r I really didn't connect with. This box set, I've liked a lot of the movies that were on here, um, but this disc in particular. Uh, well, well, we're like, this is the fifth disc in the set, so I feel like we've got a pretty good run. But yeah, this one sucks. Uh, I was not a fan of this Hercules movie. We only have one more Hercules movie left, at least on this disc, and uh, we'll talk about that next week. Remember, please be kind and rewind.